everyone, welcome back. Um, I've had a couple of people asking me in regards to what sort of gear do I carry with me for in the event of a mechanical breakdown or a puncture repair kit, either a day trip or an overnight trip. So I thought I'd go through and do a really short video on some of the gear that I carry myself in the event that I need to repair a tire or a, me a mechanical breakdown or someone else riding with me has an issue. So uh, let's go through and have a look at what I take. Okay, one of the most common repairs in the bush is most likely being a puncher or a flat tire of some sort. So I carry uh, two tubes with me, uh, obviously a front and a rear to suit my bike. Uh, I run the heavy duty tubes in the bike and these are my um, original tubes that I've taken out which I just keep as spares. Uh, obviously you're going to need a, couple of t a decent set of tire levers suitable for motorbikes uh, and a compressor which you can run off your bike. I run mine off through a, a cigarette light adapter. Um, directly off the battery. Obviously leave the bike running while I I'll pump the tyres up just so you don't get any sort of flat battery possible. Also carry, not that I need them, is uh, these are uh, for tubeless tyre repairs. I've had a couple of people on the side of the road uh, who do run tubeless tyres uh, so sometimes they don't carry any gear at all so I have come across one guy who didn't had a puncture in the middle of nowhere on the highway. Uh, I was able to use a couple of these to um, sort him out and get him back home so I do carry those anyway, they, they weigh nothing, so they don't take up any space, so I'll just throw them in as, as a bonus, you never know who else needs a hand. And obviously in most small lightweight containers, which are packed tight so they can't rattle, I've got um, tube patches and any repair kit, glues and um, sandpaper to wrap up the tube, so any sort of anything you need to make a repair is in there. And uh, lightweight tyre pressure gauge, that's this little portable one, even though there's one on my compressor, uh, I still have that to um, check my tyres on every ride. One other thing you may have a problem with if someone happens to have a fall or break something, obviously the old um, race tape and cable ties pretty much fix anything with those. Uh, a bit of electrical tape, I do carry a small amount of um, positive and negative positive and negative wire uh, just in case I've got to bypass any sort of wiring. Uh, a very lightweight um, uh, tester power tester so and in here electrical fittings uh, some fuses joiners and anything I need to make any small repairs uh, to get back home and a, and a short and a small fold up uh, knife and in here I have just basic miscellaneous um, nuts and bolts and a few o-rings and a few small gaskets so uh, just enough to get you home or someone else for that matter so I just that once again weighs very very little it's really important that when you're looking at all this stuff, um, keep your weight to a bare minimum because um, it does add up quite quickly. Uh, gasket sealers, I have these are like a double sided adhesive, almost like a vinyl, they're heavy duty gasket sealer, ideal for a, a, a split on a radiator hose or something of that nature, and also a tube of gasket sealer. The old WD 40 spray lubricant, so if you've got anything that's covered in a bit of dirt or a little bit rusty up, so if you need to get a nut or a bolt undone, the old WD-40 is um, is good stuff. And just a couple of very basic tools, apart from what I carry in my tool kit that comes with the bike, I've got some very basic um, spanners that I need, shifter, um, hammer uh, for a tune-up, no, no, I'm joking, um, pliers and um, Phillips head screwdriver, so that's pretty much it as far as repairs. Worst case scenario, I've got a tow rope I carry with me also, so if you need to uh, get a tow out of the bush or you need to drag someone else with you, so um, a good length of solid tow rope, um, surprising what that'll, that trouble that'll get you out of. One other thing I do carry in my, in my gear, apart from any camping gear or clothing, is I carry quite a comprehensive first aid kit, which is from everything from band-aids down to splints, um, bandages, slings, uh, heavy duty gauzes, anything to do with a fall or even a snake bite for that matter just to um, slow the process down until we get first aid uh, along with uh, a CPR mask in the event that I uh, hope that you never have to use one but if I, ca I, I go on the theory that if I carry it I'll never have to use it so once again weighs absolutely nothing um, could save a life so so there's a quick rundown on some of the gear that I take with me when I do a day ride or an overnight ride uh, in case I need to make some repairs or fix a flat tire or whatever. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel. Uh, until next video, take care, ride safe. See you soon.